Hi guys, here we are at the site where we saw the crocodile earlier this morning. Uh, which is why I want to introduce my two uh, sidekicks slash brothers, um. Inka Brown and Ewan Brown. So the thing about this species is it, it's a, a juvenile Nile crocodile. They are very aggressive and dangerous. So they said they saw it in the spawn earlier this morning. And um, stay good. Um, so we're going to take a look and see if we can find it. This, this crocs, you know, weather, weather like this, like to um, go in the water and stay underneath. You'll probably see the head um, stick up when, uh, he, when he comes up. I see him. I oh, really? Oh, here he is. If you can get a closer look then, just come away. It's a very dangerous one, this. So I'm going to uh, give you a better look and I'll get his head, head uh, out of the water. Look. There he is. So you can see um, the beautiful coloration on, on the back of his head. Okay, so we're going to catch this fella now. Okay, guys, now we're going to catch him. Uh, we are using this, uh, it's called a top jaw rope. It's just a rope with a, a loop in it. So you're going to hook it onto his top jaw and pull him out. Um, so he will bite down on the rope so that uh, so the uh, rope uh, don't come out. So let's do it. I'm just using the stick to open his mouth. Just another reminder, this is a highly dangerous animal. Look guys, that's called a death roll. It's used to uh, rip pieces of meat off a uh, his prey. Okay guys, now we're gonna get on his back and put all, all, our, all our weight on him. That won't hurt the crocodile in any way. He, is, he has very thick scales and it will never hurt him like this. Okay. So I'm gonna go on first, you second, you third, okay? Okay, okay. So get behind me. Okay, three, two, one, go. Okay, get on the tail. Okay, so we got him here, guys. Just have to close the beak, the um, top jaw rope. So just have to get it up here, off here. Okay, it's off. Okay, Ewan, come around. Yeah. Let's tape the beak, uh, the top jaw. Okay, let's just tape it. So what he's doing is just closing the mouth of the crocodile. Um, I have it here. Um, crocodiles, they don't have a lot of um, strength opening their beak, just uh, closing. I'll hold it there. Let's wrap it around. Tight. Can I help? Yep. So this will um, help the, a crocodile not to stress that this um, um, piece of cloth we're going to put on. We're going to put it over, over his eyes so that uh, uh, the thing of crocodiles, when they can't see, they can't. So we're putting this on, just to, just to calm the crocodile. Just to help you there. So he's, when he's uh, lying still like this, he's actually building up energy. 
So we just have to be very careful. No, no, it's fine. Okay, let's go. Just to have a bit of grass in here, just have to get it out. Okay, we're gonna get on. Okay. Uh, Jan, get on the back. Enko, move up a bit. Okay, move up. Okay, we're gonna um, uh, pull it, pull, uh, take it off. Okay. He still has a lot of power like this. So we're gonna take him to the car now. He's very um, calm now. Oh, when he's wiggling. Ah. Okay, we're gonna put him in the back of the um, truck. Okay, lift up. Okay, now you can get a better look at him. You can come closer and get a nice look of the crocodile. You see this uh, webs? They are used for, for the crocodile to swim faster. And they actually swim with their um, front, front claws by their side and the back claws paddle with their tail. Um, the tail actually has a, a movement like this, like a snake. Uh, so they can swim very fast. So guys, that's all for today. We'll see you on the next video. And we will release it um, probably this afternoon uh, at a place safe and where there's no people around. Thank you guys. Like and subscribe the video and we we'll hope to see you on the next one. Goodbye guys.